East meets West this weekend in a London derby that appears, on paper at least, to be between two clubs going in very different directions. And yet in many ways, Chelsea and West Ham have endured similar seasons. Expectations have not been realised. The managers are under pressure. And the fans disillusioned. As for the owners, well, perhaps the owners are poised to make changes. It's difficult to judge the season now because we don't know what happened until the end of the season. So I think that I can answer to this question at the end. I think that at the end of the season, we will have a big press conference. <laughs> a comfortable 3-1 victory over Birmingham in midweek lifted Chelsea up to second place. However, with just five matches left, they still trail Manchester United by six points. And Carlo Ancelotti could become the first Chelsea manager to end the season trophyless since a certain Avram Grant in 2008. We thought that uh, one month ago we had uh, a little chance to come back to fight for the title. I think that uh, everyone can say that, uh, could say that you, you were crazy, you know? Our aim is to stay focused on the next five games, close well the season, this season, and after that, we can say if the season was good or no, was not good. Just avoiding relegation would probably safeguard Grant's job, but it appears that the West Ham bubble may be about to burst. Three successive defeats have plunged the Hammers back into the relegation places. And with just five games left, they're a long way from securing the nine points that Grant believes they need to survive. The one thing that is important is that uh, we need to give everything to stay in the league. I think we deserve it. If you look all the season, the football I play, the character that we show in the very, very difficult moments, the decision of the referees, including in the last game against us, we fought with everything, so we deserve to, to, to stay, but we know that nobody will give us to us. We need to do it. Another thing they need is their best player back on the field, Scott Parker, the Football Writers' Player of the Year. He was sidelined for the defeat to Villa with an Achilles injury that will keep him out of the Chelsea game too. If you take any important uh, player from any team, he is uh, very important to our team and uh, when he's not playing, uh, uh, we don't like it, but this is... Uh, this is sometimes the situation in football, we need to deal with this. The Omens aren't looking good for West Ham. They haven't won at Stamford Bridge since September 2002. But the Omens might not be looking too good for Ancelotti either. Incredibly, just a season after securing the first ever double in the club's history, the Italian may not be around to spearhead Chelsea's next campaign. And that is a sobering thought for any football manager.